Former NFL quarterback Troy Aikman, who called the game, uh, talked about what he has seen from Deshaun Watson. He did not look comfortable tonight. Uh, last week, as we talked about, the conditions were such that the passing game just wasn't going to be very effective for him or Burrow. But even last year, this was, this was not the Deshaun Watson that we had seen during those years with the Texans. And as I mentioned during the ball game, it is a, it is a different offense, but he's had time now. You know, and this offensive staff has had time to figure out, okay, well, what exactly is it that Deshaun Watson does best? It's all been built around Nick Chubb. We understand that. And Kevin Stefanski understands that. And that's not a bad way to go. And Deshaun Watson was having to get adjusted a little bit to kind of the different play, the play action off of the running game and those types of things. But now, without Nick Chubb, I just think that the, this offense going forward I would have to believe is going to look different than what we've seen under Kevin Stefanski for the last few years. And, and Scott, they, they need to get the ball out of his hand quick. Give him some short passes where he can get positive. Elijah Moore, David Njoku, they need to get the ball in their hands quickly. They do, but I don't think that's a play calling thing, Dave. It, it, to me, it feels like those opportunities are there. And Watson's not taking them. And he's kind of choosing to hold on to the ball longer. And either not seeing it or in his head wanting to make a bigger play and go downfield. And, you know, I think I asked him about that after the game. And he said, yeah, I got to get out of my hands quicker. And not, and that helps protection too, right? You don't put as much stress on your offensive line if you're not holding the ball forever. So I think that's key. Uh, I think it's interesting what Aikman was saying because – you know, I know that Stefanski and Alex Van Pelt wanted the offense to look a lot different this year. That was the plan. And, they, you know, we've seen signs of it. They've spread it out. They've sprinkled in a bunch of different looks, right? Elijah Moore here, Elijah Moore there, Elijah Moore in the backfield. Some some option looks, some RPO looks. Like, you see all this different stuff. Um, but Watson just hasn't been good enough. And it's, I know it's only two games, but where you just say, okay, make you know, you go run the offense. And especially when you have Nick Chubb, why wouldn't you not use sure. Nick Chubb, right? Like, there has to be a balance there, especially when Watson's struggling. Now without Chubb, maybe they just give total control to Watson, but it, it, it's hard for them to have confidence to do that when Watson hasn't played well. 